What's up YouTube, Jeff back again today with another very exciting Samsung video for you guys and today Samsung has released another update for the Galaxy S23 Ultra camera. This time it is the app that enables you to take raw footage with your S23 Ultra. I'll be talking about the update, tell you guys about the new features. Before we get started, I want to thank my son Jonathan for giving us a couple dinos to hang out. We got the T-Rex and the Triceratops. We always appreciate that. I also want to give a quick case update because people are always asking which case I'm using in the comments. They have the MagBack case which enables you to get MagSafe functionality with your Galaxy device. MagBack also makes a case, a uh, wallet, that you can stick on the back of the case, rather. Uh, it's right here, this is the black one. Put it right on there, just like people can do with their iPhones. It's very sturdy, it's not coming off. You're gonna go out to uh, somewhere for the evening, you don't wanna take your full wallet. It's great, fantastic, fits a couple cards in there. I've been using it for quite a while and absolutely love it. Another thing I love about the MagBack case is that unlike some other uh, MagSafe compatible cases, that are out there for Galaxy. This one fully works for the S Pen. Of course, you know, sometimes having that MagSafe functionality can interfere with your S Pen. You get some input lag or it doesn't work at all. That's clearly not the case here. It works great with the MagBack case. Uh, that's really the main advantage of this particular case over the competitors out there. And one of the reasons that I use it because I always like to use my S Pen as well. Uh, the other thing is they include some mag sticks, which are these little short little metal like sticks you can stick the case to. I use it to put it on my dashboard in my car, then I can easily mount my phone. I'll show you guys some B-roll right there. Let's me access any additional apps that I want while driving. I do have Android Auto, but sometimes it's just helpful to have that extra one there to kind of look at it while you're working and you know doing your stuff. Great protection overall as well in terms of drop protection. Everything is nice and covered. It's got a raised up lip as well. So not only do you get that uh, MagSafe functionality, you also get a very protective case. If you guys are interested in checking it out, I'll drop my uh, discount code up here. Should get you a nice discount. Also, they might have some holiday sales running as well. I'll drop the link in the pinned comment description. We certainly do appreciate MagBack for being sponsors on the channel. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk about the update. We're gonna go right into the Galaxy Store here. This is the app right here, which I've talked about on the channel quite a few times before. This is the Expert Raw application. Version 3.0.02.8 on November 16th, 151.88 megabytes, very large update in terms of size. They actually do not have a change log here, but if you navigate to the Expert Raw application, which I'll remind you guys, if you haven't used it before, what it actually does, here it is. Uh, the Expert Raw application allows you to basically take photos in raw format on your Galaxy S23 Ultra. And of course, that's very, very great if you want to edit these in something like Adobe Lightroom. In fact, there's a direct Adobe Lightroom integration with this. You can download from the Galaxy Store as well, so that once you shoot in raw mode, you can import it into Lightroom and then you can pull out all that extra color and stuff like that. You got things like a histogram up here. There's a lot of other advanced settings. In fact, they've got a really cool thing called Astrophoto with a sky guide in there. Um, they added some of these features to their Galaxy Enhance X app as well. Uh, you can see auto share to PC and tablet, uh, high efficiency raw, which saves some space. You can save it in both raw and JPEG formats. There's also expert raw labs now that allows you to do multiple exposure Astrophoto. And here's the new feature that I want to talk about today, the natural density filter. Now what the natural density filter does, first of all, is right up here in the top corner. Uh, you can turn this on and you can see here that with the ND filter, what it's going to allow you to do right there is basically change the intensity of the light, which keeps your photos from being blown out in really bright conditions. Now with a physical camera, what you do is have an actual ND filter attachment that if you got like a mirrorless camera, uh, like my Sony Alpha camera, you can attach the uh, ND filter to the top of the lens and then it will actually physically filter out all that high intensity light. But with the ND filter, you've got 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128. Uh, if you keep, oops, there we go. 128, um, 256, 512, and 1000. So these are different strengths. Um, and you can kind of see some examples here. Obviously, look at this. Here you can see when I'm shooting this and there's not much light, as I go up, it's really making it dark. So this is obviously not a physical attachment. It's doing this with computational photography. So if you feel like you need to kind of get a little bit better shot, change the way that it's looking in terms of the lighting, this is a great option. And I've been playing around with it. You really can get some nice shots if you have a little bit too much light or not the right amount of light. Um, this indie filter option is definitely a great one and I'm glad to see Samsung add it to Expert Raw. So definitely it's something you have to play around with, kind of get used to when it's appropriate to use it, mostly outdoors when the light is just so overpowering that you can't take a quality photo. 
But uh, once you get used to it, it's a very great tool to have in your uh, photographic toolbox for your Galaxy S23 Ultra. I definitely would encourage you to download it. Also play around with some of the other options like the astrophotography, uh, like the other one, the multiple exposure. Uh, they've got a bunch of different overlays, different shutter modes, how many exposures you can take. They've added a lot of great features to the expert raw application. And there's just a lot of stuff you can do in addition to shooting in raw with that computational photography actually embedded. So that's what makes it expert raw because it's actually an adjusted raw, not a true raw format. It's also using some of that computational photography to kind of add some vibrance to your photos. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, subscribe to the channel for more great Samsung updates. That's what we do on this channel. Also, some other Android phones sprinkled in there. If you guys are interested in the MagBack case, again, you can use my code. I'll drop it up here. Also, in the pinned comment description, there'll be a link to buy. A great case, one of my favorite cases of the year for the S23 Ultra. Sure, they'll make some for the S24 Ultra as well. So, we really appreciate them being sponsored on the channel. I appreciate you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.